Hi everyone and welcome back to my kitchen. Today I wanted to share with you guys one of my go-to breakfast recipes for those super busy mornings when I don't have a lot of time and my husband is rushing out the door to get to work. I'll be making my loaded bacon, sausage, and guacamole breakfast burritos. These are so good. They're made with homemade guacamole, bacon, sausage, peppers, loads of cheese, scrambled eggs, and some really well seasoned potato hash browns. These are great to make ahead of time. Just wrap them up in some foil place them into your freezer, and then you can reheat them in the oven, on a skillet, or even in the microwave. Now today, I'm starting out with my potato hash browns. I've got my oven preheated to 425 degrees Fahrenheit. I have about four or five cups of hash browns. I'm going to season them generously with a little bit of salt, some smoked paprika, a little bit of chili powder, and just a touch of garlic powder and then toss these together until the potatoes are well coated in that seasoning. Spread these out onto a large baking sheet and then place them into the oven for about 25 minutes until they're golden and crispy. And moving on to our next filling ingredients, I'm going to render uh, three slices of bacon. You can use three, four, five slices. I know my husband loves bacon, so I usually make extra bacon for him. And once that bacon is rendered, just take it out onto a tray lined with paper towel and set it aside. Next, into the pan, I'm going to add some breakfast sausage. I'm using five links. Just chop them into smaller pieces. One green diced bell pepper. One red diced bell pepper. And one small onion. Season this with a little bit of salt and some ground black pepper and then saute this for about five to six minutes until that bell pepper is tender and the sausage is cooked all the way through. My sausage and bell pepper mixture is all done. I'm going to remove it out of the pan, set it aside into a separate bowl, and then I'm going to get started on my scrambled eggs. For the eggs, I'm first going to melt about a tablespoon and a half of butter in the same pan. I'm going to keep my heat at a low setting and then add in four large eggs and mix them into that melted butter with my spatula. And after about a minute, I'm just gonna add a sprinkling of black pepper, season the eggs with a pinch of salt, and add a few tablespoons of cream. And now let's bring it all together and make our burritos. Today I'll be using some extra large flour tortillas. I've chopped up my bacon into small bits. I have about a cup of some grated cheddar cheese and I have my homemade guacamole sauce. I'm going to include this recipe on my blog. You can head down into my video description box, click on that link and you can get that full recipe on my website. I've taken out my uh, potato hash browns, have my sausage pepper mix, scrambled eggs, and I have some hot sauce. The first thing I like to do is add that guacamole sauce into the center. This way you're going to get some of it with every single bite. Add a generous sprinkling of that cheddar cheese. Add the potatoes and then I also like to crush them so that they fit better into the burrito. Add some sausage and pepper topping some scrambled egg, a bit of bacon, and some hot sauce. And then just fold over the sides and roll the burrito right up. Once you have your breakfast burritos all done, what you could do is just wrap them up really tightly with a couple sheets of foil, place them into the freezer, and then take them out when you're ready to enjoy them. I recommend either preheating them in the oven, preheat your oven to about 425 and let them bake for at least 20 minutes. You want that scent to be piping hot. Now, if you're going to eat these right away, what I like to do is just preheat a large skillet, add a little bit of olive oil in there, and then cook the burritos over medium heat, turning every two to three minutes until uh, the sides are golden brown. You want that center to be piping hot.
And I always like to serve these breakfast burritos with a little bit of salsa, some sour cream. You can also add um, some hot sauce on the side. Let's cut into this burrito so you guys can see what it looks like on the inside. And how amazing does that look? Check it out. We've got our sausage, peppers, eggs, hash browns. This burrito is just loaded with incredible flavors. These loaded breakfast burritos are so fun to make and really you don't have to wait for breakfast to enjoy these. These are great any time of the day. I like to dip mine in a little bit of sour cream, some salsa, and then dig right in. Mmm. This breakfast burrito will knock your socks off. You guys are in for a real treat with this one. It's just loaded with so many incredible flavors and fillings. I love that cheese, the guacamole. You have those creamy scrambled eggs, the peppers, the sausage. Just a great combination of all those amazing flavors. And what I also love about this burrito is it's not too dry. It's actually really juicy. You get the guacamole, the melted cheese. Incredible, simply incredible. For the full recipe, head down into my video description box. I always leave a link there. It'll take you over to my blog where you can print it off, save it to Pinterest, and share it with your family and friends. Hope you guys have enjoyed this video recipe and I'll see you next time.